ప్రియమైన తెలంగాణ రాష్ట్ర ప్రజలందరికీ గణతంత్ర దినోత్సవ శుభాకాంక్షలు ఐ వుడ్ లైక్ టు ఎక్స్టెండ్ మై వామెస్ట్ గ్రీటింగ్స్ టు యూ ఆల్ ఆన్ దిస్ సెవెంటీ ఫోర్త్ రిపబ్లిక్ డే దిస్ డే ఇన్ నైన్టీన్ ఫిఫ్టీ అవర్ కాన్స్టిట్యూషన్ కేమ్ ఇన్ టు ఫోర్స్ ఇండియా అఫీషియలీ బికేమ్ ఎ రిపబ్లిక్ సెవెంటీ త్రీ ఇయర్స్ అగో గివింగ్ ఇట్ సిటిజన్స్ ద రైట్ టు షేప్ దర్ ఓన్ ఫ్యూచర్ ఆన్ దిస్ డే we should be proud of our democratic nation and its sovereignty i pray the highest tributes to baba saheb b r dr b r ambedkar and the other founders of our glorious indian constitution which upheld the principles of liberty equality and fraternity we must be proud of our constitution our heritage and our shared values we must all spread the spirit of republic day among all indians at this time when the nation is commemorating azadi ka amrit mahotsav the 75 years of independence our nation has made significant progress during the last few years under the dynamic leadership of our honorable prime minister sri narendra modi ji india assuming the g20 presidency moving up to the fifth largest economy in the world quickly registering new startups roaring into space industry launching the national logistic policy and approving the national green hydrogen mission or to name a few the united nations has declared 2023 as the international year of millets millets are not only a nutritious food but they are also good for the environment and could become a sustainable food in the future to become healthier and more active we should all begin making millets and their by products a basic food i will list out few of my initiatives that have been successful and gave me immense satisfaction during the last year holding of the convocations on a regular basis establishing connections between all alumni and their alma maters at state universities through the initiative chancellor connect alumni to enhance the facilities resources and knowledge transfer providing hundreds of laptops and tablets to the underprivileged and poor students through donate a laptop initiative conducting mahila darbar at rajbhavan exclusively for women to represent their financial family and other problems and offering assistance to them to overcome these problems distributing mahua laddus to improve nutritional values including hemoglobin count in particularly vulnerable tribal group people giving rajasree high egg laying variety of chicks to particularly vulnerable tribal group families distribution of fruit bearing saplings and vegetable seeds to all particularly vulnerable tribal group families and train them growing backyard kitchen gardens convincing members of the uniformed services to donate blood to cater the needs of patients with thalassemia sickle cell anemia etc in order to alleviate the blood shortage at the height of covid-19 pandemic conducting of essay writing eloquation and making of logo competitions for the students of state universities as a part of creating awareness on india's presidency of g20 countries etc but for the tireless and well thought out efforts of government of india in containment and vaccination the covid-19 pandemic would have had more disastrous effect in the country i urge everyone to exercise greater vigilance and adhere to all covid related precautions in order to counter any future waves let's all re and reaffirm our commitment to the cause of maintaining the ideals rights and values enshrined in the indian constitution on this momentous occasion of the 74th republic day on the 74th republic day celebrations i once again extend my warmest greetings to you all jai hind jai telangana